Hi everyone, Sean Bateman here, and well, I want to talk about the food banks. You see, I support the food banks because they'll help out people who are, you know, who are on disability or have very low income to actually can survive for the, until they get their next check, and also. There's some some uh, food banks that actually have a very very small budget. You see, that means they can't get can't get fresh fruit and vegetables. That means they have to freeze everything the the the, the produce, which kind of lose the, the fruit and vegetables. Kind of lose their texture. And freshness, which it's kind of BS, mind you. And I want all you people out there to donate your money to that to, to the food banks, so that can, every day they can have fresh fruit and vegetables for people to actually have. And this, and also donate besides donating money, donate. Perishables that are not have have a due date before a certain day, which is in a few like do not donate a box of biscuits, which the best before day is in one week. Donate it, it if it says bet eat before say I don't know October. 2019, fine. But not to have, say, best before a week from Tuesday. That's not okay. Plus, if you want to do something nice for a food bank, besides, for, why not donate your time to it? And also, what do you do? If you're volunteering, don't be an asshole or a bitch to people who are actually coming to that food bank and getting food. It shows that you care about that person. And it shows that there you show that, that you care about their struggles because it's hard for them trying to pay their food bills. They, their besides their food, their, their bills. They have to get. You know, they have a budget, a small budget for getting food for the entire month, which they have spent two hundred bu about two hundred bucks for an entire month for food, which you can while well, you spend. At least ten times. About at least. I don't know. Four times the amount every for an entire month. Also, plus get if you have a, fr a friend or family member that's running out of food, you know what? Do something nice for that person. You and a few friends make them a couple. Make make them some dinner. So actually, they can actually freeze down so they can actually have that food ready for ready to eat, and also they can after they. Finish it. They can actually give you back your plates, and or if you don't give them the plates, just give them the disposable plates, so they can actually, so they can put like for a picnic and what or whatnot, or maybe all the cans of that you put in the for a coffee. 
tins like like the, those those red Fulgers cans for four. If you want, you're, you're saving for to can down your chili or spaghetti sauce. And every once in a while, surprise that friend. Take them out for a lunch or dinner to actually make them feel like they're needed. Plus, so it help them get get to feel needed and actually try to build their confidence to actually get a job. That's what people. That's what you should do, but into not. But like I said, you have to care about the f do deal to, to like like the food banks. They're important. Like I said, donate. Besides, fresh donate fresh well, perishable foods that are not a week away from. Their best for date. Have have those perishables maybe a couple months away away not for their best for date. Donate money to them to the food banks. Do, do, donate your time and also be nice to people who are using the food banks because it shows that you care. This is Sean Bateman signing off.